All right, now do it. There you go. Good job. You're a pro. You are a pro. Look at and, you. And I'm pretty. <laughs> <laughs> pretty. <laughs> and Raylan's pretty. It's taken many times for me to learn. I know this garden's where I want to grow. My life was like a seed of inhibition But now I feel like a flower in the sun All's been stripped away, I know for certain That the life I want to live has just begun My Gardens where I want to grow. What's happening? Welcome to Stiver's Homestead. I'm Zach. And I'm Jen. And today we are doing a little planting in the cold. Goodness gracious, it's cold out here in Kentucky. Cold. However, see that little hoop house? <laughs> That's what we do to make sure that we can do this through the cold. So uh, we've got some family here, so y'all are going to be hanging out with me today. Uh, Jen's going to go back in and hang out with them, but we're going to plant some lettuce. I'm going to teach y'all about spacing and how to just do clipping and not taking things to head. So that's what we're going to do today. Speaking of family. <laughs> Say hi. Say hi. They're from Texas. Texas. All the way up here in North Carolina, or North Carolina. I'm, used to, I'm used to us being there. All the way up here to Kentucky. You can tell he did not dress for Kentucky nope. weather. <laughs> not here for Kentucky weather. <laughs> All right, y'all. We're going to get right at this. Get this hoop house, raised garden bed planted. And call it a night. So I'm telling old Keith here <laughs> what we're planting. I'm talking about we're gonna plant some bok choy. Um, we're gonna plant some of our romaine lettuce, some regular just starfighter head lettuce, and some red normal lettuce as well for kind of our salad mixes. Um, but I was telling about the kohlrabi and how it looks like a little alien like color yeah. orb of some form or fashion. But I want Keith to try a nasturtium. I don't know if it'll be any good that little. If it's ready, you're gonna taste some heat. Mm, little bit you of like spice it? to it. Yeah, a little spice. Right. It's like yeah. a like a radish kind mm -hmm. of. Yeah, yeah, a radish and. A I leaf. love them. So really good. Radish. But they're it's a flower. It's beautiful. So you yeah. chop that up when you cook with it. Yep. Yeah, you can eat the flowers too. It's muddy on that. Yeah, that tastes like so. Cool. Yeah. This is dill. Man, that's a lot of flavor. And that, <laughs> and that little bitty, little bitty plant. Exactly. A lot, of, a lot of flavor. flavor. That's cool. Plant you on food, folks. Plant you on food. <laughs> Let's get in the house. Dog pound broke loose. <laughs> Daisy Lou, you're funny. not supposed to be out here. How, how did they broke in the house? Ellie, did you have fun? <laughs> How did those dogs get in the house? <laughs> they broke through the door. They broke like... Yeah, crazy dogs. Uh, those dogs were in the, on the front oh, door. Oh, we got the ball. <laughs> oh, we got the ball. When I was rolling it, I said, come here and I got the ball. You got the ball. <laughs> we got the other. 2.0 of the family. Oh, <laughs> That's Samantha. Hi. That's little Zachary's mom. Zach's knee deep in the bed. I am. So we're actually going to have Raylan and Zach. I know, not me. <laughs> Regular Zach. I'm I'm big Zach. <laughs> slash Zach. He don't want to be called anything different than just Zach. Um, so he's going to come over and they're going to help me plant some of this stuff. But I wanted to talk about lettuce just real quick. 
So if you're planting just leaf lettuce and you're not taking it straight to head, lettuce only needs to be about four inches apart. So you can really pack a big punch and a lot of plants in a small area when it comes to your salad mixes. So if you're wanting to grow salad mixes all year and you have a hoop house, so ours is four by 12, you know, we're gonna get 50 plants in here just because it's gonna be so tight together. So you want your rows about 12 to 15 inches apart, um, but between the plants in the row, you can, only, you can go just four inches and that's fine because you're just doing clip, clip and take and they're gonna keep growing back. So kind of treat it as if it's maybe a tea garden like Jen's grown. You know, you can clip it back, it's gonna grow right back all year long. So we're gonna go four inches apart, rows 12 foot, so we'll probably have three rows and line these things all the way down and we're gonna get the kids over here to try to help us out a little bit. Let's do it. We're gonna let Zach go first, then you go next, okay? okay. All right, Zach, you wanna get in the Because I know how, I know. He's gonna get a little dirty, all right? Mm -hmm. All right, <laughs> come here. Oh. All right, you sit right here beside me. Okay, let's actually put it over here so they can see, okay? Yeah. All right, so we're gonna dig a little hole. You got this? Dig a little hole right here. A little bit bigger. All right, that's good. Just like that. All right, so we're gonna pull one of these out. Uh, FYI, did you see how easy that came out of that hostel <laughs> straight right there? All right, so we're gonna plant it to here, okay? So you can set it in there. What kind of lettuce is this? Sky, Skyfos Butterhead Lettuce. All right. Very good. It's pretty. Oop, I kind of pulled it out. I messed it up on you. Hang on. Let me get you, and I'll let you do it, and I won't bother you. You did better than I did. All right, try that again. There you go. Mm -hmm. And what you do, let's bring it in. All right, now do it. There you go. Good job. You're a pro. You are a pro. Look at you. And I'm pretty. <laughs> <laughs> pretty. <laughs> and Raylan's pretty. <laughs> yes, you I, are. <laughs> I, I planned it before. You planned it before? Yeah. Well, good job. You did a great job. All right, Ray Ray. <laughs> We're gonna set our three rows up here. No, you can do it from right there. <laughs> put, yeah, your, in. put your leg down, Freddie. After her turn, it's my turn, right? Okay. <laughs> All right. We're gonna go. plant some more over here, right? Yes, we are. We're gonna plant this whole bed. Oh, yeah, so oh. it's going to take a long time. It's already cold out. <laughs> here. Now I already got your hoe. Put it down in there. The hole right there. Right there. You have to get it all the way to its. Oh, that's okay. I'll hold it up. All right, now do it. Now don't see how I did I'm not doing it. I'm just holding it up. I'm not sure all the holes are going to do. Oh. All right, you want to bury it. And, and he's going to see what the hole going to do. All right. And I'm going to see. Will. We'll come here every day, but not tomorrow because I'm leaving tomorrow. No, no. You're going to come here every day, but it's not sad. tomorrow. Yeah. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah. That was a long time. A long trip. It's going to take a, a long time for us. Okay, it's still my turn to tell you he's going to work all the hoes. I think your turn, it's my turn. <laughs> no, it's going to be my turn now. Please. No, it's that turn. Yeah, you can't go two turns. That's right. You yeah, take I, need turns. To, I need to take it out. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Oh. Remember, you're the pretty one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna play all these on All right, Raylan found you. You won that round, no, Ray Ray. I need to get him. All right, we'll tag, tag him. Yeah. There you go. All right. Okay, you go hide, Ray Ray, and I'll count for him. Okay. All right, close your eyes, Zach. 
One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ready or not, here he comes. Down Ray Ray. Your turn, Ray Ray? Yeah. All right. One. Call yes. One. Two. Two. two three, three. Four. four five. Six. six seven, seven. Eight. eight nine. Three. Ten. Ready or not, here I come. Do y'all just keep hiding in the greenhouse? Y'all need to find a different spot. Yeah, hers keeps finding me like that. Back. All right, Ray Ray. Ready? Yep. Go hide somewhere else besides the greenhouse. All right, close your eyes, Zach. One, two, two three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ready or not, here I come. So, if you haven't noticed, I'm planting and also playing hide and seek with the kids. So I'm the counter because they count a little fast. That's what family's about, right? Decent gardening, family time, beautiful night. Get outside, people. Just because it's getting dark early and it might look cloudy, doesn't mean we have to stay inside on the couch just yet. Found you. Found you? Yeah. No one can do that! No one! Yeah. Alright, I got the counting. Okay, y'all, it is all planted. There is 45 different lettuces in here. So we got romaine, we got starfighter, we got cashew. Um, I was able to get one bok choy in there. Uh, that one was still extremely moist, so it's kind of hard to get out of there. Um, if you are using the host tool trays, just make sure your, uh, your plant, your soil um, that you're using it is a little bit drier um, because it's a lot easier to pull out. If it's super moist, um, it's gonna be a little bit harder to get out. However, as you can tell, the dirt is pretty dark. So what I use always, anytime I plant anything, is our liquid fish. It's beautiful stuff. Um, it has so many nutrients in it and it just pumps up a plant for sure. Uh, so I don't, when I plant the plants, I don't water with water, I water with this. Um, and it really does the, does the job. So I'll link this, the hostel trays, the hostel tool. Man, I really hosteled it up today. I'll link all that down below in the description if you're interested in seeing any of that stuff or using it yourself. So before we kind of wrap this up, I really want to talk to y'all about a little bit of something. Um, so the time hasn't changed here yet, but it's getting dark super early. I think it's like 6.30 or 7 or something like that. What time we got, Keith? 7.15. And it is, on, I mean, on the camera, it looks a little lighter than it actually is. It's really dark. So two months ago, this was full sunshine. The sun was barely even starting to set. So it's easy to get ourselves into the mode of going in the house, staying in the house, because it's getting dark early. You know, don't let that happen to you. Right now is the best time to garden. Fall gardens are so much fun. You ain't sweating. There's not bugs stinging you. And lettuce is super easy to grow. Very simple. So while you're thinking and you're inside and you're like, man, it's just easy to stay in here, fight that. 
fight that urge to stay in the house, get outside, plant something. Because if it ain't raining or snowing, you can plant it. So I just urge you all to fight your inner self at this moment and don't let that take control of you because it's very easy. We're getting close into that extremely easy time zone of getting depressed. Um, and I know a lot of people struggle with that. And I face it too. I mean, there's times where I just don't feel like doing anything. Uh, I just like sitting in the house, uh, taking it easy. And it's easy to fall into that mode of whatever. You know, we had a good garden year. I won't worry about it now. Uh, but to be self-sustainable, you can't do that. You've got to plant all the time. You've got to plant every chance you can. And y'all, I'm extremely behind schedule on getting things planted, Jen and I are. I was just telling Keith that I haven't planted my beets, haven't planted my onions, haven't planted the garlic, haven't planted the shallots, but that's okay. I do have our cauliflower, our cabbage, and now our lettuce planted. So just take it one step at a time. So if you're looking at, it, oh, I almost forgot about the peas and the rattlesnake pole beans. So if you're sitting there, you're like, man, I just, I can't even tackle this entire garden. That's okay. I don't know, Keith, let this take about an hour and a half do this something about an hour and a half do this one bed and that's with hand tilling it too so i mean that was something that i probably didn't technically have to do i probably could have done it as i planted but i just i like to get in there and dig it all up maybe it's just because i like being in the dirt i don't know um but an hour and a half an hour and a half of my evening got a little exercise in wasn't sitting inside eating snacking watching tv whatever it is uh, and i got one bed planted so i'm calling it a success even though i got a lot of things else i need to do i'm gonna get it done you know, I'm going to get that done. It's going to happen, um, but you don't have to do it all in one day. So just take it one day at a time, plan a little, call it a night, feel successful about it. Um, but that's about it, y'all. I feel like this video was a little bit short, but that's how you plant lettuce. So just remember, leaf lettuce, four inches apart, rows 12 inches apart, and that's all you got to do. Now, we don't grow hardly any head lettuce. I don't even think we're growing any head lettuce at all this year. Um, we're growing all just leaf lettuce. Um, we have our cabbage that'll go to head to the till garden. Not a fan of leaf lettuce. All right, head lettuce. Don't even worry about it. Quit wa wasting your time waiting for an entire head to form before you can eat your lettuce. Grow this leaf lettuce any kind, romaine, butterhead, which butterhead can go to head. Don't have to, don't even let it do it. Um, but we're planting cow shoot, uh, arugula, romaine, all those different things. It's just cut and grow. It's like you mowing the grass in the middle of the winter underneath your hoop house cut it have you enough for a salad let it grow back cut it again so uh if you're still wondering what to do in the fall garden you still have time even if you're in some of our northern states uh trust me you got this so i hope you all enjoyed today's video uh jim wasn't in this one very much but that's okay uh she'll be back in the next one i can tell my battery's about to die on the camera so i better quit rambling love y'all we'll catch you on the next one bye